Hello folks, in this video we will be discussing about the locator strategy to be used uh, while implementing detox. So uh, this is a sample react native feedback app which I developed for demo purpose. So normally if you want to uh, locate elements such as a uh, header or a text, text box, check box, uh, we uh, will be using a inspector where we will set the capabilities uh, to launch and install app and then we will uh, inspect uh, each element to find the xpath but uh, in detox since we have access to source code we can include test ids for element to be automated we can also uh, inform dev teams to add test ids while uh, developing so uh, it is recommended to use the uh, test id which will work smoothly for both android and ios you don't need to uh, change the uh, locator strategy for uh, uh, Android and iOS. If you follow uh, test ID, you can uh, have test scripts working for both Android and iOS. So in this video, I will just quickly uh, show you how to add the test IDs. So if I need a test ID for this uh, header app, which I need to validate, I will include test ID app. header okay uh, I, I, I already uh, provided test IDs for uh, most of the elements so for this checkbox I need a test ID so I will just include test ID checkbox and for the submit button also I will follow the same procedure to include the test ID value so this is how uh, you will provide test ID. Now you can directly use this test ID in your uh, detox test scripts by uh, using this element find by dot ID. Thanks folks.